And Jane, another issue that Minister Dutton is closely watching is the investigation into his Border Force Commissioner. Are we any closer to learning his fate? Well, if reports are to, believe, to be believed, um, a decision about Roman Quadvalig's future is imminent. Uh, Peter Dutton this morning acknowledged that the government is in talks with Mr Quadvalig and that the investigation is in what he's described as the sensitive stages. You'll remember that Roman Quadvalig stood down in May last year over misconduct allegations. It relates to a relationship he had with a younger female staffer. Now, two separate investigations were launched and we're told that the um, head of Prime Prime Minister and Cabinet uh, finalised his review last month. He handed it to the Attorney General Christian Porter, who we understand has recommended Roman Quadvalig be sacked. So what has to happen now is that senior members of government need to sign off on that decision and then it goes to the Governor General. So really it's a watch this space for some sort of announcement. But this has been one of the most drawn out and expensive uh, internal investigations in the public service. And Mr Quadvalig has earned about half a million dollars while he's been on leave. Uh, for his part, though, he has denied any allegations of misconduct and he's also, we understand, quite frustrated uh, about just how drawn out this process has been. Jane Norman, thanks for the update.